President Tsai Ing-wen attended the opening ceremony of the Yushan Forum on Tuesday morning. In her opening address, she called on the audiences to support Taiwan in face of Chinese oppression. Outside the forum, Tsai responded to Taipei Mayor Ke wen criticism about her handling of cross-strait affairs. Mayor Ke had said cross-strait relations were at their worst in 30 years. As for comment on Tuesday, Tsai said her cross-strait policy was rational and in the best interests of the nation. The president attended the opening ceremony of the Ushan Forum. In her opening address, she spoke about Taiwanese values and cross-strait relations. China's efforts to isolate Taiwan have done nothing but hinder regional prosperity and stability. I ask that you continue to stand with Taiwan and work together with us to, force, to forge stronger regional partnerships in the years to come. Tsai spoke directly to the audience, urging the high-level delegates to support Taiwan. The attendees included former Canadian Prime Minister Stephen Harper, an official of the U.S. State Department's Bureau of East Asian and Pacific Affairs, and former White House Press Secretary Sarah Sanders. Officials from countries including the Philippines, India and South Korea also attended the event. Speaking to reporters, Tsai responded to criticism from Taipei's mayor, who said cross-strait relations were at the worst in 30 years. It's not a question of whether cross-strait relations are good or bad. It's a question of whether cross-strait relations are in the interests of our country. Over these past years, we have adopted a very rational stance on cross-strait relations. That is, when China encroaches upon us, we neither provoke nor advance, yet we defend our country's position. In terms of cross-strait exchanges, we've sought to maintain normal exchanges. It is China that's chosen to deploy tourism flow as a political instrument. With just under 100 days to election day, Tsai said she would not be taking time off from presidential duties to campaign. She said that being president was a 24-hour job and that her priority was governing the country.